The doctor suspects that the little girl is pregnant. Her stomach was very swollen. After examination, the doctor found nothing wrong, but Anna's belly was getting bigger and bigger. She couldn't put down her pants anymore. Her mother was very worried, but she could only comfort her, although they went to the hospital many times. The doctor always said Anna wasn't sick. At night, Anna suddenly screamed. She rolled over in bed with a stomach ache, and she even started to vomit. Mom and Dad took Anna to the hospital again. The doctor said again that Anna's health was normal. Mom was very upset. She argued with the doctor and demanded a new physical examination. The next day, the doctor brought bad news. Anna had a serious gastrointestinal problem. She needed an operation right away. A tube was inserted into Anna's nose. She cried out in pain. Her mom cried too. After the operation, Anna had to have a tube in her nose all the time. She couldn't eat properly. At school, she can't go to class with her classmates. Anna's life was miserable. The doctors told Anna's mom and dad that there was no cure for her illness. Anna would spend the rest of her life in therapy and on medication. Mom and dad were desperate. Mom found a great pediatrician on the internet. She called the doctor over and over again, but the doctor was very busy. He didn't have time to see Anna. Mom decided to go to Boston with Anna to see the pediatrician. The girl's stomach is very swollen like she's pregnant. Anna can't put her pants down anymore. Her belly was getting bigger and bigger. Mom and dad took her to the doctor many times, but they couldn't find anything wrong. Mom had to take Anna to a famous pediatrician in Boston, but the doctor was very busy. Even though mom kept pleading with the nurses, they couldn't see the doctor. Luckily, the doctor decided to treat Anna. When she took the medication, her condition eased a bit, but the medicine had serious side effects. Anna's stomach still hurt. She knew she wouldn't recover completely. Anna began to refuse treatment. She lay in bed every day without eating or drinking. Mom cried in despair. Dad decided to take Anna home to rest. But soon after, a miracle happened. Anna recovered completely, and her swollen belly was back to normal. That day, her sister took Anna to climb a tree in the garden. Anna fell into a hole in the tree. They called the firemen to help. Anna was rescued from the hole. Miraculously, she was completely unharmed. The doctor examined her and said she could live like a normal person. It was a miracle, because the doctors had said that Anna's condition was incurable. Anna has a tube in her nose all the time. She can't eat normally, and couldn't go to gym class with her classmates.